hydropeptones here. Um, clutch number six uh, has shed, so I decided to make a quick video of all the hatchlings. This is the male pinstripe 100% hat for clown. The pairing, of course, was a clown female to a pinstripe yellow belly head clown. And uh, this little guy, he'll be available after a few meals. This is just a regular pinstripe. There's no yellow belly in it, in him. So, there he is. Next, um, let me show a yellow belly clown female. Okay, they are pretty um, fired up, let's say. Here is a firefly, no, firefly. Here's a uh, yellow belly clown. Okay, this guy is, does not want to cooperate. So, okay, let me let me put him back um, into the other box. And this one right here, this is a uh, yellow belly clown, and this one I'm keeping. Really cool. The blushings on these animals are amazing. Over here. On both sides, she's also a pretty reduced, really great looking snake. So here is the female. Next one is a male. And this little guy is already sold. Uh, same as the female, really nice blushing. He's a little bit more busy pattern on his sides. He's being pretty shy. <laughs> but, uh, Maybe I can try to unwrap him a little bit. Really cool looking animal. Same as the female. So here are two uh, yellow belly clowns. Next, uh, let's see the pinstripe clown. Also great combo. Mm, also not too many of those. Um, there's no yellow belly in it. Um, you can actually see that it's it's a little bit darker than the regular than the pinstripe yellow belly clown, which I'm gonna show you in a second. Really cool looking animal. Okay, and now the okay, I'm gonna put this one here also, so we'll have the whole clutch in here. And now here is the gem, the triple. Um, this is a pinstripe yellow belly clown male. Oh, and the pinstripe uh, clown was also a male. I don't know if I mentioned it, but here is the triple. You can actually see the the pattern is more uh, variable than on the on the pinstripe clown. There are also the circles over here on the sides that are um, not uh, visible on a regular pinstripe clown, and also. As you can see, he's uh, much lighter than the regular pinstripe clown. Here you can see the difference. Okay, they're trying to escape on me all the time. So this little guy is also staying with me. And uh, hopefully I'll plug him into some breedings in the uh, upcoming season. Okay, now he's on my tripod. Okay, really cool looking snake. The, oh, the yellow belly also makes him much brighter. Okay, this little guy is just nuts. He just want to escape. So here is the triple. So here is clutch uh, number six. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, Stay tuned because uh, I'm going to be posting some more videos soon. Uh, clutch number 7 should uh, shed in, in, in a while. Uh, I forgot to make a video of them uh, after they came out of the eggs. So I'm going to skip that and I'm going to make the video after they uh, shed. So the next video should be cutting um, of clutch number 8. Uh, which is the last clutch of the season. And it was a pastel genetic stripe to a kingpin yellow belly, uh, uh, yellow belly uh, male. And there is also some pretty cool outcome in there, so stay tuned for that, and see you guys in the next one.